Um, hello? Um, hello? Um, hello? 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 I said. Yo, what up? What's going on, guys? How you doing tonight? Hope you're doing well. It's me, Tired Man, 1774. Just being a tired man, you know? It's what I do. Uh, how you guys doing tonight? Um, missed the one yesterday. Didn't miss the one today. Boom. And I think that's where you would dab, right? It's really a uh, drive point the home that you're the alpha here. Um, <laughs> same Jesus. <laughs> What's going on, guys? I hope you're doing well tonight. Ah, uh, the spicy keychain. Uh, what's what's it? Dominic? Damn it, Dominic! Is that it? With the spicy keychain. Um, but let me say hi to everybody. Doctor Squared, if you're still here. Hello, hello, Moogle fam. Hello. Well, what the fuck? Thanks for the forty lewd bits. If you wanted that to be text to speech, uh, well, it's gotta be a hundred. But I think you know that already, I think. I'm not trying to talk down to you. Um, but anyway, Dr. Squared, hello. Moogle Fem, hello. Bobby, hello. G, my man, hello. Code man, hello. Eric, hello. You want me to marry you? I think you gotta ask uh, Dukes about that first. It's Space Bud 1774 sec. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I thought... So the way I heard that was like... It's space, but 1774, you know, like B-U-T, not B-U-T-T -T kind of butt. Um, Bobby, thank you for the 20 months. That's almost two years of subbing. Thank you, dude. Uh, bum, bum, bum. Sorting through some Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh, shit, you're playing Yu-Gi-Oh? Damn, dude. How, how is Yu-Gi-Oh these days? I, I, I never played Yu-Gi-Oh. I had one deck. One deck, probably like a pre-built way back in middle school, and I left it at my public library by accident. So somebody got free Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Um, and what's up, your rock? Hello, hello. How you doing? Dominic, you rat. How could you Whoa! do it to your own brother? Um, hello. Not on for long, but I hope this stream goes well. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Yo, Tapur, thank you for the 46 months. That's a long ass time. I hope you're doing well, Tapur. Thank you, thank you. Um, Gia, uh, are you able to use the FFC volume thingy, whatever? What do they call that? The the mixer. That's what I have to use for like every stream I watch. I have turned up the volume. Uh, as pretty much as loud as I can without blowing out my eardrums. Because in order for me to turn up OBS, I have to turn up my my headphones as well. It's kind of it's kind of lame. It's space, but consider 1774. But he has a butt. Competitively, the game is toxic, but casually, it's everything you want. Well, that's good. Oh, that's actually really cool, G. Did you uh, join any of those? like local online things. Uh, I know Pokemon's doing that too, where um, local leagues can do their online stuff. I've been thinking about uh, joining my local one, but just with my weird schedule, I've been kind of hesitant. Yo, Blue, it's good to see you again. How you doing? Yeah, the compressor. No problem, G. Yeah, um, I don't know what it is though, like, you're not wrong. There's a lot of streams that are quiet, and then there's other streams that are incredibly loud. But I'm assuming the loud streams are people with mixers that have multiple different audio inputs, and they can control those volumes independently. I unfortunately can't. Um. A 13-hour shift. Well, I'm glad you don't have to work as long today. At least you're making that money, though, eh? Ooh, what kind of models are you making? I'm doing pretty good today, Iraq. Today was uh, pretty chill. Um, so I was going to start about 30, 40 minutes earlier, but I went upstairs, 
to make a quick cup of coffee. And uh, I just mentioned this in the Discord as well. So um, Dukes' uncle, he actually just got into Final Fantasy XIV for the first time because... Oh, but man, what's going on, dude? Did I miss you say something before? Or did I just see your name now? Either way, hello. Um, and because uh, he was talking about possibly playing it and then I let him know that they're doing like a free campaign until I think the next three days or something like that where you could play for free without a subscription and he's loving it so far so I went up there and for like the last 40 minutes he was talking to me about what he's been doing today and stuff it's cool it's a fun game so I'm glad he's liking it <laughs> oh excuse me That's fair, G. I'm glad you're having fun with that, though. Um, and, you know, speaking of, like, helping run local local tournaments and stuff, I am a Pokemon professor again. So, technically, I could help local leagues organize sanctioned tournaments once those return. Um, but the cool thing is the Pokemon company announced that um, I think they're going to have the first beta build available to all professors next month was the last I heard. So in December where um, they're actually going to make it so you can have sanctioned online tournaments other than the, uh, the players cup that they run themselves, which has been their only real sanctioned tournaments during the pandemic so far, because Pokemon's never had to not play in person. You know what I mean? So they weren't prepared for this kind of thing, but um. What's it called? Um, but starting soon can actually do online tournaments and not just through the Pokemon company. So that's really cool. Oh, that's cool. So you're into Warhammer. I, I hear that's like a crazy money sink. Oh, by the way, you rock. Are you still working that job you got a few months ago? Because you were just starting, like, the last time I streamed. Yo, PK, what's going on, my man? It's good to see you again. Alright, so. Oh, wow, so even Tekken has, like, updated their netcode as well. That's cool. D uh, does it help a lot? Because... Wasn't the netcode one of your biggest complaints about Tekken whenever you had to play online? I know, right, PK? I mean, to put into perspective, in 2021 in May, it'd be seven years since I started streaming, so that's nuts. Also, none of these daily challenges are very good for me. I don't have... I literally don't have a psychic deck anymore. I traded away my Dragapults. Um, I don't have any standard fairy decks because fairy is going away as well. Um, and I have a kind of maybe tier three dark deck I can use. So I guess I'll go with that. Wow. Five bucks. Let's go. Dark and Steel Pokemon. Yeah, and kind of similarly, Eric, they're going to be moving Fairy and Dragon Pokemon. Um, I think many Fairy Pokemon are going to be Psychic instead, and then... A lot of dragon Pokemon are going to be colorless. <laughs> dragon my pult over that face. I'm doing pretty good, PK. -er. Uh, yesterday was my first stream back, and I did go into what I've been up to uh, during the stream yesterday. You know, I should probably find out where that was and make a highlight so I can point to that for some people. Um, but I guess uh, one thing is uh so i have a second hard drive now so i'm able to uh record my streams since i don't like twitch's new ad ad um policies and whatnot and how people can be interrupted 
at random because Twitch just feels like, oh yeah, who cares what the streamer wants? Um, I'm going to be uploading all my VODs to YouTube. Now, the one from yesterday will be going up after I stream today because as per my partner contract, I cannot upload a VOD to any competing service for 24 hours. So uh, by the time I'm done streaming tonight, I should be good to uh, put up yesterday's stream. Um, that being said, I don't have like timestamps. It was like a five hour stream. So even if you would get your answer in the VOD, you'd probably have to search for it. Um, but I did talk to Dukes about that yesterday. I'm going to start writing down little timestamps uh, for myself. Actually, you know what? Now that I mentioned it, let me have a notepad file open. So I know that if I want to note down like, oh, about 24 minutes into the stream, this is something I should notate on the YouTube video. Um, work has been busy. Oh, the ease restrictions. Holy moly. Oh, and you just woke up. Well, good morning, Tepor. That's crazy. Like, I'm not surprised that your work is going nuts. How... How's everything going pandemic wise over there? Are your um, cases down, people being safe, other than, you know, the 500 people going to your place of work? Uh, love Warhammer. Oh shit, you were gonna need to get surgery just to keep doing that? Well then I don't fucking blame you for not doing it. And, you know, everybody that I know is into Warhammer really loves it, but I know almost nothing other than apparently it's, like, crazy lore and super involved and expensive. <laughs> those those are the things I know about Warhammer. Yeah, there's been Dragon Pokemon for two to three rotations now. Zarud's pretty cool. Um... To be fair, I, I'm kind of biased. I tend to like the monkey Pokemon. I mean, the first Pokemon in Pokemon Red, uh, I guess I should say the first Pokemon ever that I got to level 100 was a Primeape. So I guess I'm a little biased. I tend to like the monkeys. I wasn't At first, I wasn't a huge fan of a Rangaroo, but he's grown on me. He's grown on me. Pokey babies. Are you a Pokey baby? fish bacon. Is this one of you guys? Maybe that could be somebody from the Discord as well, like Thurindos, maybe? I'll add ya. I'll trust. I'll, I'll, I'll trust in fish bacon. I think I'll be safe. Monkey. Did you guys hear about the new monkey? Like in real life? Sci-fi on crack, eh? <laughs> the bottles must be made out of crack. Oh, shit. You're going to get a 3D printer? Ooh, I bet... You know, I bet the people that make the Warhammer miniatures and models, they're probably... Once 3D printers start coming out, they're like, fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> oh, is he? A Rangaroo is Poggers. Actually, how is a Rangaroo in the video games? I've never used him in the video games. I only know him through the TCG for the most part. Well, just last night. Oh, 3D World. Yeah, I'll be doing runs of that. If um, I'm not going to make any promises like, yeah, I'm going to start running the game seriously tomorrow. Um, but I'll definitely be playing it at least when the Switch version comes out. I mean, I kind of have to, right? It's kind of my game. So at the very least, uh, I'll be playing it then. Grookey is cool. I, I, I actually really like Reelaboom. Like that whole line is pretty cool. That's who I, that's who I used in uh, Sword Shield. It's been kept under control for the most part. Okay, well that's good to pour. So you so you feel at least marginally safe. 
<laughs> Yo, crack? <laughs> Did somebody mention crack? Oh, uh, that makes sense, Yurok. Like, as much as I... D so, I, gu I guess... I can't really have that much of an opinion on it since I really don't know how the game Warhammer 40k really works. And honestly, I didn't know there were tournaments. I thought it was more of like a Dungeons and Dragons type of RPG game. Um, so actually, tournaments are new to me. That's interesting. Hmm. He's used mostly for doubles. Okay. Oh, he's a trick room as well. So when you say um, lets his partner repeat their last move, do you mean like they can hit twice in a row? Or do you just mean next turn they could use it again even if it's a move that you're not allowed to use again? Like uh, Solar Beam or something? Where you have to charge up again? Well, look, Blue and G said the same thing. Holy moly. Sobble is baby. You're not wrong. Oh, cute Buckeye's into it as well. Oh, it lets him use it again in the same turn. That sounds broken as hell. Wow. So so do most teams these days have a uh, Orangaroo? It, it sounds like you're gimping yourself if you don't, huh? That's nuts, actually. Has there been anything in the TCG that's allowed you to attack twice? I don't think so, right? That'd be nuts. Unless it was very, like, specific things you can attack twice with, you know? I don't even know what I have. That's really cool, you rock. Honestly... A lot of things like TCGs, board games, video games, and even music hobbies during this pandemic has definitely blown up. Like, I mean, people have a lot more time on their hands, and I bet especially with the stimulus, you know, people spent some of that extra money on things. I mean, I bought, I bought some Pokemon cards myself. Rangaroo was very rare. Okay, so there's some pretty easy easy counters. Interesting. You hate it and love it. <laughs> Interesting. Interesting. Remember how I, I made like multiple teams worth of competitive ready Pokemon on Sword and Shield and then I never played again? I remember. Yo, Moody, what's going on, dude? Me, Dukes, and Cooper, we've been pretty good. We've been pretty good. We've been working on our own stuff. And uh, yesterday I got into it more, but I've been getting back into Pokemon TCG. I've been playing my guitar again and researching music and equipment. And I want to get I want to get back into and learn more about mixing and recording. Um, I've been doing part-time work for Dukes' mom and the company she works for. I'm actually getting more responsibilities, and I've been taught some things that'll actually probably help me later in life if I want to get a normie job. Um, but how about you? Penguin, you're way too far, dude. My dick don't reach that far. You're literally thousands and thousands of miles away. What's going on, Penguin? It's good to see you, my man. That's really cool to for. And you know, I could see myself doing that with uh, Dukes. Like, Dukes, can you paint my Warhammer guy? Oh, shucks. Oh, shucks. Life hasn't changed much. I'm, I'm making my life change because I, uh, 
I was not doing well for a while, and I'm, I'm finally getting out on the other end of that. Hell yeah, G. Hell yeah. And I, I was actually going to hit you up soon asking if you've still been into that, because I know for a while you're getting really into playing and recording. Uh, I'm finally building up the calluses on my fingers again. Um, I'm almost there. I'm almost there. So, my goal tonight is to try and win some games. Um, I have not really tried doing any of the latter in a long time, but I do want to earn a bunch of coins. So the newest expansion just came out last week. Yeah, last week. And um, I have, like, none of the new cards, so... I need to get 200 coins. Each 200 coins, I can buy another pack in game, trade locked. Um, actually, curious, curiously, I want to see um, how much vivid voltage codes are going for. I'm not going to buy any tonight, but I might have to eventually if I want to get any of the new cards. Um, no, you didn't tell me. What are you going for now, dude? I know you've been working hard at school too. Oh, that's really cool, Blue. How how do you like doing that speed run? I know Pants has done has done uh, speed runs of Sword and Shield, but I never really watched any other runs. No, and that's fair, G. I want to... Um... So, by the way, I want to get a... Um... Have you heard of the, the amp, the Boss Katana? I'm actually looking into getting one, hopefully for Christmas. Um, every day I'm looking, though, like... I'm like, should I sign up for financing? Should I, should I really spend, like, 20 bucks a month for the next two years of my life to get this early? Like, um... So at home, at my parents' house, I still have my tube amp. Uh, I spent like 600 bucks on that back in like probably whew, 2010, 2009. Um, if you heard of it, it's a PV Classic 30 is what I got back in the day. Very good for cleans and low gain like blues and stuff. Um, and uh, so if I wanted to go like tube amp, throw some pedals in the front to get that kind of tone. I could. I could. But right now... So one of my favorite amps I ever played um, was uh, my friend's dad got one of those Roland Micro Cubes. Um, it was just a little, like, 2 or 5 watt amp. Just digital modeling. Like, it didn't sound great, but it sounded good for the like $80 price tag um and uh and the crazy thing is I've been watching so many videos looking up so much shit on the boss katana and it's not the same like the katana is not a straight up digital modeling amp it's a solid state state amp that has the the five different channels it's more of more of a real amp I guess you could say than a normal digital amp um, um, <laughs> Dukes has a kalimba. Yo, scrub. Enjoy that lurk, dude. What's up, Alpen Goats? Uh, double degree in math and computer science. Good luck, Penguin. What do you want to do with that? You just playing Spanish? Oh, <laughs> you playing Spanish? That's funny. Do you, do you understand a little bit of Spanish? Or is it like all... Or is it all Spanish to you? Um, so, oh, I will scrub. Oh, yeah, I wanted to show you guys. He is sleepy boy today. Look at him. Look at that boy. And I found out how I can actually zoom in. If I go over here. 
Oh god, no. Let's not zoom in on that part. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Kev? How you doing, man? Machine learning. Well, that's awesome, Penguin. Did you um, did you finish the line of schooling you were doing, or um, are you just gonna like start new in the middle type of thing? You know very little Spanish. <laughs> it's near incomprehensible. Yeah, and I agree. And especially sword and shield in general, it's pretty pretty straightforward what you need to do. Ooh, a puppy. Alright. So I'm sorry for the people. I did I even finish my thought process on the music stuff? I don't know if I did. Um But yeah, I'm looking into getting the katana because I want to be able to make a lot of sounds. And I'm not looking to get the best tone ever. So if if one of my dream amps if if I just came into a whole bunch of money, I would I would probably want to get a Soldano SLL SLO either 30 or 100. I doubt I'll ever need a 100 watt tube amp. Um, but so like if I if I want to go all out, um, you know that would be one of my dream amps right there. Um, but. Positive Grid Spark. You know, I just saw that on one of the websites I was looking at yesterday, but I forgot to look into it. Let me, uh, I already have Notepad open. Let me, let me write that down so I don't forget. I, I've been doing a lot of research and watching videos and stuff lately. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm gone off the deep end again with uh, music stuff. Positive Grid Spark. Excuse me, I just realized I burped. Oh, you were doing communications. Okay. Well, good luck with that, Penguin. I know you could do well. I know math and computer science has been two things you've been into since I've known you, so good luck. <laughs> You're learning, Blue. You know Spanish. You don't have glasses. That's That sucks. Or are you just too lazy to find them type of thing? Yo, it's Bear. What's going on, dude? Yo, Luna, what's going on? It's good to see you. Yeah, Riot is expensive now because you guys were freaking... Um, spamming riot too much and then nobody wanted to do it so now it's a little a little more expensive thanks blue thank you i have been blessed by the burp okay you're just too lazy to find them i, I was like picturing like um fucking rocco's modern life whenever uh oh, what was the name filbert would like lose his glasses he didn't know. He couldn't see shit. That's what I was picturing. Yeah, you guys riot anyway. Yo, I'm glad to hear that, Luna. I've actually been really busy lately, too. Um, I've been doing some part-time work. I've been getting back into music. I've been getting back into Pokemon. I've been doing a lot of research. Um... Oh yeah, I forgot if I mentioned this. I might have said it yesterday, but I've realized um, for my future, I would love it if I could open either like a card shop, you know, like TCG and board games, or a music shop. Um, so that that's like a long-term goal of mine as well. I've looked, and that'd be cool. Like, imagine I could stream from the store and be like, "Bitch, buy my guitars, buy my Pokemon, buy this dick." No, sorry. I won't say that. 
<laughs> That's fair, Penguin. But if you can't read it, did it really happen? <laughs> Sold. <laughs> TCG Music Dick Shop. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, that's cool to pour. Well, and you know, it's probably a lot safer for you guys over in Australia to go out in public. I would not trust anyone here in America. That's for sure. I could do an online store, but I don't want to because, I mean, I, I would do the online store in, in, um... can't think of the word I want but basically I'll, I'll do both at the same time and because uh, especially if it's going to be a card shop I want to be able to hold league tournaments for all the games like Pokemon Magic Yu-Gi-Oh um, but who know well you know if those become more online then who knows maybe it won't be too advantageous to have in person anymore so I don't know I don't know gotta work on that Oh, dang, Bobby. I'm sorry to hear that you got kicked out for a while. I've, uh... In the past, I've left my house and gone back multiple times, so I've been there before, Bobby. Good luck. Damn, Luna. That is fucking busy. Good luck with selling the house. And honestly, having to go through any of that shit during a pandemic as well has got to make it even more stressful. Good luck, Luna. Are Did you guys move already? Or are you still in the process of moving? Bear, just just buy a whole bunch of Pokemon cards, obviously. Oh, that sucks that you had to deal with cheaters. For me, um, I know the local game store around here that I used to go to to play at the league. Um, I actually checked out a couple months ago if they were open again or not, and they are. Um, although, with the, the rise in cases lately, I think restrictions have been put on certain businesses again. So I don't know, but they were they were holding things like pre-releases and things at least a couple months ago, which didn't feel right to me. But I, it, I was going to say, it's hard to blame them. Because, you know, that's your livelihood, but at the same time, like, is it really worth opening up a card shop in this time? Probably not. Oh, good luck with that, Luna. I hope you guys can find a suitable place. I'm glad you guys are doing better, Bobby. Better, Bobby. Alright, enough stalling. Let's play some video games, I guess. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, that's really cool, Bear. Like, do you do you want your second store to also be mainly online, or do you want that one to be more um, more of a physical place? There aren't people willing to come in the car shops when open. That that's also fair too. That is fair as well. And, like, I, I can also see the view that, like, during these times, having something fun and enjoyable and a hobby can really help mental health. But what good is your mental health if you might die? They got banned from the store. Um, you know, speaking of which, since I'm a Pokemon professor, uh, well, an organizer... Pokemon professor. I'm, I'm able to look up the list of people that have been banned from Pokemon sanctioned tournaments and it was crazy. I, I, was, I was looking through the list to see if there was any names that I recognized. There was one person with the last name that I knew of, but I don't think it was someone I actually knew. But um, 
I saw there must have been a whole family that got banned on the same day. Um. Uh, I think it was like four of them with the same last name. They all got banned indefinitely for some kind of cheating. Uh, it doesn't say why they got banned, but I'm assuming they like maybe they were like counting cards or maybe maybe they used like fake cards. I don't know. Like, yo, Aerosmith, what's going on, dude? Yu-Gi-Oh turns require you to not smell, as in like you have to take a shower beforehand. God, I wish every game did that. I, are there even any Tangalos in Standard? Hold on. Oh, that's right, Bear. So when you said um, you might invest that extra money into one of those other income streams, is that what you meant, Bear? Wait, really? He was marking his deck with stink? Hello, Alpen Goats. Hello, hello. Oh, that's really cool, Bear. Do you already know where you want to open that? Or is that still something... Something you got to figure out? Yeah, that sucks that there were that many cheaters, you rock. Like, it was that rampant, you know? <laughs> Gotta admire the graft. Oh, God. That's disgusting. So you can get disqualified for being smelly. I can... Now... Now, that, that leads me to the question of... How long would it take until, you know, say somebody got banned for being stinky... How long will it take for them to sue Yu-Gi-Oh or the store or whatever was hosting that tournament for discrimination? Like, and I wonder where the laws will lie. Like, so this is a, you know, this tournament is usually done by private companies who can make whatever rules they want, but is that still discriminatory? You know what I mean? I, I really, so I literally don't own any Tanglas for standard, but let's see, your opponent active Pokemon is now poison, put two damage counters instead of one. Okay. 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 I see you. Tangle drag. Switch when your opponent's bench Pokemon with their active Pokemon. <laughs> Gentle slap. Though, you know, those Tanglas, they're not the worst. For some basic bitches? That's not bad. That's not bad. <laughs> oh, good luck with that, bear. Good luck. That's exciting. Yo, Lime, what's going on? That's what Mae Valentine does in the anime. <laughs> Legally can't sue for being objective for disruption via smell. Interesting. I, I I would assume that they try to make that as like um. They obviously had their lawyers look it over. Is what I'm trying to say. Yo, Charlie, what's going on? It's good to see you again tonight. Yeah, and you know what? That's a good point as well, Luna. I guess when you sign up for the tournament, you probably also sign up kind of like, you know, when you agree to a TOS type of thing. So Magic the Gathering, it's in the rule set. Okay, yeah. That all makes sense. You need Factions Codex. I'm going to have to look up look that up because I don't know what codex is in relation to 40k that sounds like uh, an oversight oh really G so you had to be that guy to kick them out more power to you dude prize pulls an actual monetary value 
And that, and I guess that's another thing, Bear. Uh, as long as the rules are clear, there shouldn't be any legal precedent there. <laughs> Tangela destroys Pika ROM decks. I'll take your word for it. Well, Pika, is he um, is he weak to grass? No, weak to fighting. Weak to fighting. I think you're lying to me. No one in this deck is weak to grass. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. By the way, guys, I'm a little behind on chat. Give me. A, uh, I'm still trying to catch up. Pretty strict tabletop gaming policy. Family friendly. Okay, until after 8 p.m. I think that's oh! fair. Sa -sa! Hey, I clicked this last time, but whatever, sec. <laughs> that's true, Wang Fu. You did click that last time. Thank you again for the 37 months. Great to see you, Wang Fu. What's going on, dude? Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Oh, you have evening class? Good luck, dude. I'm doing pretty good tonight, though, Lime. I'm tired as fuck, but I'm doing well. <laughs> Am I still on? Hey, this isn't the title screen. It's the versus screen. I've made it past the... Well, you know what? Fuck it. We're back on the title screen. You can blame Penguin for that one. Nice. Got off work. Having dinner. Hanging with the special human. Sounds good to me, Charlie. Hopefully work hasn't been too bad for you. Okay. That's fair, G. <laughs> Drop kicking them into the sun. Good shit. You would never lie about Tangela's? I think you lied about Tangela's. Oh shit, my chat just went all the way to the bottom. Um... Uh, oh, I'm almost caught up. I'm not too far away now. Deodorant behind the counter. Hopefully not, like, used deodorant, right? Like, see, but that would get pricey. Like, if you had to have new deodorant for all the stinky bitches, unless there's not that many stinky bitches. It's just the faction's rule book. But the way, the way you made it sound was... Can each person have like slightly different rule set, or is it, or is this codex for each store? How does that work? Yo, it's Green Wolf. What's up, dude? Hello, hello. ABA therapy. That is. I know I've heard of that before. That is. Shit, I can't I can't think of it. But I'm glad you like your new job. That's cool. Oh oh I didn't even think of spray deodorant. See, I never used spray deodorant. I never trusted it. Hey, I mean if you want to give it to me, hell yeah, Erisman. I'll take it. Um, hello? Is that motherfucking skank? What's up, dude? How you been? Hell yeah, bear. Okay, so each codex is a mass produce. Oh, so is there like a bunch of different factions you can play as type of thing then, you rock? Okay, therapy for autistic individuals. Okay, um, actually the part-time work I'm doing, I'm doing like the administration and billing stuff with Dukes' mom for a, um, it is a company that actually offers a lot of services like that. Um, they do things like on-the-job trainings. They um, get you um, therapy and um, things like that. They can give you life and job coaches. Um, they do um, community service with special needs people. It's actually really cool. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, dang, Green Wolf. I, you know, college seems tough for everybody right now. Good luck, dude. 
Sounds good, dude. Thank you, thank you. That was to Erismont, by the way. Boom. Imaginary boyfriend. That's a goat. That's so awesome, Charlie. And you worked hard for that shit, too. The company pays me. I, I'm technically an, um, an employee for the company now. I, well, I am an employee. I get paychecks and everything. I'm on the, the payroll. Um, I started off as just Dukes' mom's like assistant, but they've been giving me more and more responsibilities because I've been doing better than some of the other workers that have been there longer than me. You know, like, you give me work to do, I do it. That's how it works. That's how it works. 15 to 20 factions. Wow. Okay. Even 7 to 8 is a lot. So, at first, I was um, technically an independent contractor working as her assistant but they put me on as a as a real employee so they'll, they're actually taking taxes out of each check so so at least i might actually get a return for that or at least it'll go towards my self-employment taxes from streaming so uh, that's actually a bit of a relief oh that's actually really cool you rock I like when games get better and expand over time. Ah, oh, that sucks to pour. Alright. You guys are always too fun to talk to. And it always feels bad, like, stopping in the middle of the conversation to play games and not fully pay attention to you guys. So. Uh, I don't want to play this deck. So... Quick, someone say one, two, or three. Ah, uh, so you guys all want to have Zeshadup. Zeshadup. Carrot face. So now the reason I don't want to play this one is because... It's a decent deck, but it got worse after the recent um, rotation. I did bring it back up to standard, but this deck actually works better with a Mewtwo and Mew GX. And I don't have any on online yet. Because you're born July 3rd. Okay, yeah, everybody wants to see the best deck in format right now. Okay, sounds good, Yurok. You enjoy your painting. I'm going to finally play a game. So this is ADPZ, the deck I'm playing. Unless unless things have changed over the last week with the new set, which I don't think so, this is considered the best deck in format. So you guys just want me to be a tryhard. Team Cowboys. I... Yay, I like going second. Although I guess technically ADP likes to go first. Excuse me for my coffee sounds. My coffee grimes. Ooh, secret rare air balloon. I didn't even know there was a secret rare version of that. Thanks for the good luck. I'm gonna need it. Honestly, a Deden or a Crobat start is one of the worst starts you can get because of this ability. In order to use the ability, you have to play it from your hand. So if you have to start it, then, well, you don't get to utilize that ability unless you can pick it up somehow. Oh, thanks a lot, Tapur, and same to you. Stay safe. <laughs> don't drop the Deden. Throw some metal goggles. Let's hammer that energy away. I said, let's hammer that energy away. Fuck yeah. I, sh I probably should have waited until he had a water. I still have two more hammers, though. Um, we can quick ball into a ADP. Well, Marnie. 
Okay, okay. He's not playing a VMAX deck. I think we're playing a mirror. There's energy spinner. So I can get my water energy. Oh! Fuck, yeah. We win. But you guys didn't even get to see how the deck works. Whatever. That's how you do it. First win of the day. All right, sounds good, Charlie. You have a good time. Oh shit! I don't know how how um the value is in real life, but in the online game, the secret rare energies are worth a lot. Uh, last I saw, a secret rare dark energy was like a hundred plus packs in game. Boop, ba, boop, ba, ba. Literally first try. All right, let's try again. Jamosian, it's Pika Man. Whoa, Charizard. Oh man. Okay, so they're making me go first. Let's see, what do we get this time? Okay, Zacian start again. I'll take that. We're not gonna put Zamazenta on the bench yet, because if this isn't a V Max deck, we're against. Don't really want to waste the uh, the bench space. Volcanion. Okay, there's a few different fire decks that are in the format right now. Um, are any of them V Max? Senta Scorch. If this is a Senta Scorch deck, then I may want this. Um. So I could put the energy, because I do have an energy switch. Um, all right, we're gonna we're gonna take a chance here. We're gonna do that. We're gonna do this. I think we want to switch out into Zamazenta. And then we'll just Intrepid Sword. Okay, not not the best three cards, but we're we're doing it. Ooh, yeah, that, that's pricey for a Pokemon card. God. And you know, and think about it, because energies are the one kind of card you can have more than four of in any deck. So, like, if somebody wanted to fully bling out their deck, then... God, that'd be so expensive. Like, because cause let's just go on an average of 10 energies a deck. That's like 600, 700 quid. Which is not too much different than uh, American dollars. Probably be similar price between five and seven hundred dollars. <laughs> yeah, the the good doggies. See, look, just like that, he's already pretty much powered up. But fuck, but hell yeah. Um. Although a fire deck discarding energy isn't as disruptive as other decks. Um, do that. I have to research. That's going to get rid of two out of my three bosses orders. That's going to get rid of one out of my two energy switches. But I need ADP. I need a water energy. And I need it this turn. Okay, so we got that. I don't need to put that energy down yet. Um, shit, okay, 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 hold on. Let's switch the energy. I'll put, actually I won't put metal goggles on him. I'll save that for uh, air balloon if I need it. Switch to the deck for basic energy. I, I gotta use this, I think. Um, to guarantee the water. I'll discard Cherish Ball. Actually, maybe Metal... I mean, either way, I'm probably gonna Deden. We'll get our water. Then we did den. Can 
hammer again. Fuck. Um, I could saucer Antization. I can quick ball for a crowbat. And hope I get a switch or air balloon. That's not good. I already used a den this turn, which means I can't use a second one. There's energy switch, but it's a two retreat cost. That's not good. That's actually really not good. I needed to get ADP out this turn to use altered creation. Now I'm behind. Um, I mean, maybe energy switch from Sashian, but then, then it's stuck on him. Shoot, I may have to pass. Well, I'll use Intrepid Sword and pass. Fuck. I'm a turn behind now. There's the switch. Okay, Bobby, you get some good sleep, dude. God, I can't believe I got the energy I needed, but I couldn't switch back into him. That's a shame. And I'm pretty sure I do run Air Balloon in this deck. One or two as well, and I didn't find... Oh, well, two switches were already gone. That's why. So half my switches were gone. I'm not... I'm probably gonna get marnie this turn, right? Did he... Yeah, he hasn't used, like, anything yet. Probably gonna get marnie Yeah, there's the den for a full new hand. Stack is 40 more damage for each fighter energy attached to this Pokemon. And it's 40 plus. He's got three energy. He's already doing 160, but... VMAX's can't hurt. Oh, he weldered. VMAX's can't hurt Zamazenta. <laughs> Fucking cherish balls, dude. Alright, um. So this is tough. This is not. exactly the situation I want to be in. Um, so can he one-shot me next turn? He can theoretically get two, three, three more energy on him. That's seven. Seven times four is what, 28? Plus 40 does 320. Right now... Well, I mean, I gotta do it. It's my whole game plan. I gotta switch into him, but the question is... Well, no, because I already do have to take a turn to use it. I'm not gonna put another energy on him now. But if he's still alive next turn, maybe. Um, I think, I think, I think... We start powering up Zamazenta, because that's my possible win condition here. I don't think I win. I don't think I win. That being one turn behind really, really hurt. Um, I don't really need another card here. I think we just Altered Creation. So what Altered Creation does, by the way, all my attacks do, what, 30 more damage? And uh, I take an extra prize card for every every knockout. <laughs> yeah, you, you like my character? I just I let it do the random avatar creation when I made it, and that's what it gave me. Did he just? So he's confident. He's confident he's going to be able to boss his order around my Zamazenta. 
So he's at five energy, and I don't think he's manually attached yet. Which means he, he'll probably get up to six. Yeah, he's only got one in the discard. If he gets up to six, that's 240, 280. If he can get one more energy, which he's probably getting right here, he can knock out. That sucks. All right, we're knocked out this turn. I have energy switch plus attachment for next turn. And I gotta hope I can just wall him with Zamazenta. The fact that he hasn't Marnied me at all because he's been using Welder as his supporter has actually helped me out quite a bit. Okay. So got that. Got this. Okay, Metal Saucer. Um... I don't know if there's really anything I need to search for right now. Um, I think I hold on to my hand for now. Everything else is a liability. So now we just start swinging. Oh shit, I, I can knock him out next turn. Okay. Now, how many bosses orders? So he's already got one boss in the discard. Probably plays three. If we're lucky, he only plays two. Oh, look, he just bought Eldegoss. So that's a Pokemon with an ability. You place it on your bench. You can take a um, supporter out of your discard. He's going for boss. All right, he's already got boss in hand. He's got the Eldegoss. All right. All right, so he's gonna knock out Zation, which means I lose. I lose. He's he's. If I can't Marnie next turn, I lose. Well, actually, wait. I do knock him out, right? I might still have a chance. I think we just did den. But that, well, I mean, I already have liabilities on the field. If I think, I think I have to do this. I need to Marnie him. Or not. Um. Wait, have I literally not used any Marnie this game? That means four Marnies. Well, I mean, I guess they could be in my prizes as well. Um, air balloon. I don't. I don't think attaching helps anywhere. Um, so he doesn't have another attacker ready. Now, what I might want to do is research just so I can get a Marnie in my hand for next turn. No Marnie. Are they all prized? Fuck. I really could have used that. All right, we have a chance. We have a chance. Marty's taking a smoke break. So... So he's up to three. He wants to discard an energy from me. Burning Train does 180. Am I weak to fire? Oh, he got... Oh, reset stamp. Like, oh, he got the Marnie? 
I am weak to fire. Oh, he got all four. I we lose. We lose. He 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 got three energy this turn. That sucks. That really sucks. Well, I'm glad you feel that way, G. Like honestly, I'm stupid. Like, and I mentioned at the end of my stream last night, like, every time, every time I go off the deep end and take a break and then come back, I just realized how much I just let my mental issues get in the way. I, I always have so much fun with you guys, and then I just realized how much of an ass I've been. <laughs> the doggies one in your heart. Like... But I'm not gonna do that shit anymore. I gotta stop being a little little baby, you know? I gotta grow up one day. You know what? We'll go first. I usually go second. Let's see what it's like going first with this deck. Demon dogs. Another Zamazenta. Let's see what we got. Whoa, he's got fancy. 2013. Is that like Worlds 2013? Okay, so this is a Pika Rom deck. We got ADP. I'm not gonna put the goggles on Zamazenta. I mean, there's not really anything to do. We just attach. This is actually shitty. No quick ball, no Zacian to Intrepid Sword. That's a pretty shitty start for turn one. Yo, welcome back, Bear. Oh, gee, I'm sorry to hear about the funeral, dude. And I hope you can get yourself back to as good as possible, as soon as possible as well. Well, there's the water energy I need. Gotta get rid of a second research, a metal saucer, and goggles. Putting goggles on this doesn't... I don't think really helps. Oh, they're playing the, uh, the electrode version. That's a crazy card. I forget exactly how it works, but I remember it being crazy. Hell yeah. Throw down Zation. Wait, do I really... Can I really not switch out again? Is this really happening a second time? I play four switches, two air balloons. God. That actually really blows. And no quick ball to get either Crobat or Deden. Okay, Luna, good luck on the sleep. It was good seeing you again. Oh, I'm glad to hear that, G. Okay, we just got Martied. Hmm. Once again, I had, like, turn two ready to altered creation, which is what you need, like, every game. But I just couldn't switch out of the active spot. This Zamazenta is being more of a liability than a help. Like, look at this shit. I I'm stuck here again. This deck almost never dead draws either. That's nuts. Um... This is... Well, there's a switch. It's because no Tangela. But I'm glad, G, that calf has got your back still. She did pop in towards the end of stream last night, so I did get to say hi to her yesterday. Oh, that's good, at least, G. I don't even have any metal in the discard to utilize these metal saucers. Okay, he researched, so we're not getting Marnied this time. That's good. Yeah, are these... These might be like World's 2013 sleeves or something. I, I, I could have essentially won already, 
being two turns behind, though. I mean, I could still win. That's the craziness about ADP. Like, I'm two turns behind, but it's not over yet. I'll write this. See, now I wonder... Would I have taken an extra prize card if I was able to get that altered creation off and he just... Um, and just... Um, SD'd. Whatever they call that. Honestly, standard, in my opinion, is the most fun it's been in a bit. Other people don't agree, mainly because of this deck right here. But as you can see, it's not perfect. It's not a perfect deck. There, There's definitely valid complaints about being able to take extra prize cards. There's definitely valid complaints with that. I'm not going to deny that. Finally switch out. Let's quick ball that energy away. Do I even want to grab anyone? I already have one Zacian. I got another Zacian in my hand. Um, I don't think I gotta do anything crazy, honestly. But maybe... Maybe just pick out one of these guys just in case I need it next turn. We'll throw down an extra Zacian. We're gonna Metal Saucer. Get him more powered up. I can even attach, but attaching right now wouldn't help me, at least not with this water. Um, oh, well, I could energy spinner for a uh, metal energy. Do that. And I could to den. I could, I could, I could, but I'll save it for next turn. We're going to alter creation and set up for the win. If I survive this turn, which I should, then um, then I can ultimate ray and power up a second Zacian, just like that. Oh, and gee, by the way, speaking of which, um, I want to start organizing pretty soon tournaments. Oh, this is a Pikachu VMAX deck. This isn't Pika ROM. I didn't even. Okay, okay, it's just Fat Pika. Um. Oh, but yeah, I want to start running tournaments with the community and stuff, and. What I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to collect as many staple cards and common cards for most of the common decks and try to give them away to as many people as I can so more people can make decks that they want and uh, join tournaments in. So um, if that's something you'd be interested in, obviously these are for fun tournaments. Um, I'm going to try and get extra cards for as many people to join in. That's interesting, G. Yo, what's up, Dark Shadow? That's me, Space Doodle. And you know, it's funny, because I call Cooper, Cooper Doodle. Ooh, didn't get the Dark Patch. Well, I just realized, he went through like his entire deck. He's down to 11 cards already. Fat baby, fat baby. Fat, 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 fat. Oh, yep, he's going to switch into Raichu. He's going to... Oh, no, Bolton, eh? Oh, because Raichu needs a third one. I was going to say, he could do 160 damage plus paralyze me if he could switch into Raichu. Okay, yeah, gee. I'll totally... Totally... Almost definitely need help with that, actually. Um... I don't think I need that water for anything. We can metal goggles this boy. Um, well, actually, 
Fuck it, I could throw that water energy onto Zamazenta. Because now that this is a Pikachu VMAX deck, he might be useful at some point, but he's probably going to get sniped with the boss's order. Um, and then I think at this point we did done, just for a new hand. Go through our deck a little bit. Crobat for next... I probably don't need this many Cherish Balls, honestly. Um, I don't need Energy Spin or Energy Switch. I don't need either. Yeah, I think we just Ultimate Ray, and then we'll have two different Zacians ready to go. Unfortunately, he'll still have 20 HP, and he'd be able to do pretty big damage next turn. But I think I think this is the play. Oh shit! I don't have enough energy. I only have one metal saucer, none in the disc. How many are prized? Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What do we play? Eight, nine steel energy? I wish I could look at my deck, my deck list right now. I don't know how many energy I play. Oh, Dark Shadow. I could show Koopa Doops. He's sleeping right now. Where is it? <laughs> oh, look at that boy. Oh shit, I'm paralyzed. Alright. And no switch in sight either. Alright. Um. What we gotta attach here. Honestly. We energy switch one of those friends. A cherish ball for Deden. Come on, switch. I gotta get a switch here. Whew! The last one. The last one. I'll hold on to everything for now. Oh, resistance! That sucks! I'm like, oh yeah, I should kill him! 260 with Altered Creation, I do just enough. Oh, resistance! Mmm, having a two-shot blows Dungus, dude. Okay, sounds good, G. Yeah, I'll definitely hit you up. Um... But actually, that helps me out. Yo, Rito, thank you for the raid. Ah, raid. Thank you so much. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How you doing tonight? Oh, he switched out. How many bosses? One down. Arnie, air balloon. I think I have to put air balloon on this boy. Um. That sucks though. Two hammers, two energy switch, two bosses. No more switches in deck. They gotta be prized then. Cause how many did I use? Two. Wow, two are prized. That's unlucky. Alright, we got some hammers. Shoot. Shoot. All right, <laughs> um, that's just unlucky. Um, I think we Marnie. I think we Marnie. <laughs> There's the two bosses, okay. Okay. 
Oh, I'm doing pretty good, Rito. Thank you so much. I hope you get some good dinner, my man. There's one of my switch. And what, another hammer. Oh, with boss? As long... Oh, I win next turn. I, I, I think there's no way I don't win. He can't take three prizes this turn. I have two Zacians ready. Even if, even if he survives, I can switch out and attack with this one. I have a switch plus air... Mm, okay, I don't have switch possibly anymore after the Marnie. Um, no switch, but air balloon allows me free retreat unless he can paralyze me again. But I think he one-shots that? Yeah. That's fine, we win. Oh wait, oh, I shouldn't say that. I don't have boss anymore. Hey, you cute streamer. Fuck, I don't have boss anymore. Um Okay, we may not win. There's still a chance we lose. Ooh, budget. There's actually a couple of good budget decks right now. Timmy Timmy, thank you for the 46 months. How you doing, dude? Um. And there's no way... There's no way... I can get a boss's order right now, huh? That actually really sucks. Um... I can't professor's research. I shouldn't get one-shotted, so I should be able to energy switch so I, if I have to. But I can't attack with him next turn unless I can switch switch, which is unlikely. One switch is in deck after that Marnie. The other one's in my prizes. Um, I don't know if I have another air balloon. I should have one more air balloon, unless it's not in deck, I don't remember. It might not be in deck, that might be my other prize. I may have a switch and an air balloon, which is actually really unlucky. Two switches and an air balloon in prizes for a deck that you kind of want to be able to switch freely? Not very good. It's good to see you, Timmy. How's everything going? Oh, and Kaleo, what's going on, man? How you doing? Not overly terrible, hell yeah. Yep, sounds like that could help, G. Haha, <laughs> card goes brrr. Alright. Well, there's Switch, Hammer, and Boss. Those are all the cards I wanted this last turn. There's Switch, so he's gonna do 160 plus Paralyze. Or 130 after the damage decrease. Fuck. Alright, um... I do have Energy Switch. Alright. We're fine, we win. That was close. That was close. What do we get? I'll take it. I think I can buy a pack from the, the shop now. That was close. I'm doing pretty good, Kaleo. I'm doing pretty good. I'm glad you could pop in. <laughs> and that's fair, Timmy. I was kind of in the end game of a, a match where I needed very specific cards and I needed him to have not have specific cards, so um, that wasn't a very easy thing to follow either. I love how there's so many, like, emote combinations on this website that just makes sense for so many situations. Honestly, Rito, that was me until about 
five years ago now. I had Pokemon cards as a kid, never learned how to play. I love the way they look because I like Pokemon. And then about five years ago, my girlfriend, she actually knew how to play. And when I found that out, I'm like, hey, why don't you teach me how to play? And it turns out I really, I really like this game. There is new things with me, Kaleo. Um, I have gotten back into music. I've been playing my guitar again, and I've been researching uh, not only like guitar equipment, but music mixing and recording and stuff like that. Um, I've been getting back into the TCG here. Um, I've become a Pokemon professor, so I can actually run tournaments in the future. But in the meantime, I want to run fun tournaments for the community. I'm going to start collecting a bunch of extra cards to give away to the community so more and more people can join. Dude, I want to try D&D. &D. I never ragged on it, but, you know, I was never like, oh yeah, I have all these friends to play with, so um, that's still something I want to try out. Yeah, for, for our fun tournaments, it'll be digital tournaments for the online game. Um, in the future, though, like I could, I could do real-life sanctioned tournaments, but those aren't going on right now because of the pandemic. Um, but I believe in December, Pokemon Company is going to release their, their new client for Pokemon professors to do sanctioned online tournaments. That'll probably start in 2021, though. Um, hi, Cooper. How was your nap, buddy? Did you get some good sleep? You get some good sleep? Let's see if the camera can see ya. Aw, oh, look at that puppy dog. It's your puppy dog. Alright, am I gonna get Rainbow Fat Pika? Oh, we got doggy. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> that that reminds me of... You guys ever play Mega Man Battle Network? That just reminds me of that. Hi, Cooper. Thank you for the yucky kisses. Thank you for the yucky kisses. What's up, buddy dog? I would love to do a D and D camp campaign with uh, community members at some point. Uh, definitely not for my first campaign or anything. Once during your turn, if your active Pokemon has any psychic energy attached, you may heal twenty damage from it, and it recovers from a special condition. A special condition, not all special conditions. That's. To me, that wording makes it sound like if you have multiple special conditions on you, which can happen, um, does it choose one randomly? I wonder how that works. Oh, that's not a bad idea, like a, a one-shot campaign. Oh yeah, gee, you want to know some budget decks? Let me, um... So honestly, like, my favorite... TCG content creator these days. His name is Tricky Jim. I don't know if any of you guys know him. Um, but he's knowledgeable. He's nice. And uh, he's got... His YouTube channel has a lot of decks on it. And um, he has a website right now. It hasn't been updated with the new set yet. But I know he's going to be putting more on there. Let me see... Let me see if anything... His YouTube might have some better, more budget decks. Like, uh, the Dragapult VMAX is probably more budget than it seems, because Dragapult price has dropped dramatically. Let me see, uh, I'm actually curious as to what those go for. Yo, Mr. Diddle, what's going on, dude? It's good to see ya. Okay, they're all co-workers. 
That definitely helps. Oh, is Cooper being weird? Hold on. <laughs> you don't you don't guys gotta see that. Um Yo, what's up, Dragon? Alright, sounds good, Kaleo. Thanks for popping in, dude. I was looking at Dragapult. Alright. Yeah. Wow, even the full art's only going for two packs. They want to... Three packs of the new set. They're just offering one pack. That's not. It's pretty budget for a V. But there, I know there's more. So there's a. There's Altaria decks that don't use any V, V Max, or GX as far as I'm aware. There's. um. Let me see. I'm trying to think. Oh, there's a Whimsicott deck that people have been playing. I think that's pretty budget. It does look like they use a Deden GX or two, but those are fairly cheap these days. I'm, I'm going to try and get extra copy of those as well for everybody. Um, let me see. I'm trying to find one of the Altaria decks. Oh yeah, there's a crazy Excadrill deck, but like you have to use you have to use your brain a lot with that one. Honestly, Alchemy VMAX is also a pretty fun deck that I want to help Dukes build as well, and I don't think it's too expensive. But yeah, I would look into Whimsicott. Let me see what this looks Fun. like. I'll put this video in the chat. Haha, <laughs> you're going through withdrawals? Well, I'm here now. So hopefully you got your fix. It's good to see you, Mr. Diddle. Is everything going well for you? All right, Rito. You have a good one, man. Thanks for popping in and thanks for the raid. Oh shit, you're still at work? Do you get to go home soon? Oh, there's um So, there's some dark toolbox decks right now. Um Well, I'll post the uh the Excadrill Excadrill video as well. I've actually played against this deck a couple of times and uh, you have to know what you're doing, but when it works and it works surprisingly consistently so that's for Excadrill. I'm trying to see actually, Pokemon TCG Dark Toolbox Let's see, when was this? Oh, this is for expanded. We don't want expanded. Oh yeah, let's look here. So there's... <laughs> well, the best dark box deck right now is Aethernatus, uh, Eternatus VMAX, but that is not a cheap budget deck, I could tell you that right now. You need four Crobat Vs, a whole bunch of dark Pokemon. Uh, it's good, but it's not cheap. It's probably one of the most expensive decks right now to build. Um... I know there's another dark toolbox that uses like slow king v and oh there's a new garbador right now that some people are trying to play yeah 
Yeah, the, the Crobat, it's the next Shaman EX. Uh, you want to have at least two. I have two online and I have two in real life too, so I'm ready on that. You'll never get your fix. Oh no, you're, even your job got COVID? Oh, uh, well, I mean, I know airlines and planes are still going, but I know they've been hit really hard for this now that I think about it. Things have been good for me lately. Um, for a while they weren't. Um, I wasn't doing too well, but things are going better now. I've gotten back into music. I'm playing my guitar again and I'm researching music, recording, mixing, guitars, all that fun stuff. Uh, I've been getting back into TCG. I want to start organizing tournaments. Um, and I've just been trying to improve my life and everything. Yo, Ice Princess, it's good to see you. I'm doing pretty good. <gasps> oh my god, yeah, Wabafet Bats. Waba Bats with uh, Trevenant. Do I still have... Hold on. I feel like I made a deck, one of those decks back... Back when that was a thing. Uh, Batty Zam. That's... Oh, remember Alakazam EX? And Mega Alakazam? I played that with some bats. Yeah, there's the Wobbuffet. As long as it's your active Pokemon. Has no abilities except for Psychic Pokemon. That's right. And then the bats, you throw down damage counters. Uh, I miss my Alakazam deck. This was a lot of fun. This was a fun deck. Oh yeah, and I had blinged out cards back then, too. Oh, this is one of my favorite cards. I love Full Art Lysander. Um, B-Bug. Oh, this was, um... Oh, Yon Mega Break. This was one of my favorite decks I've ever played. With Vespaquin. This was an interesting deck as well. Yeah, with Klefki. Oh, man. That was a fun deck. Um... Uh, I'm pretty sure I had another Bats deck, right? Dumb Dark. <laughs> Gar Garbo Mooby Flooby. Uh, me and my naming. Oh, yeah, the Mewtwo, Mega Mewtwo EX with Garbodor. Uh, this is one of my favorite full arts. I have this in real life, if I remember correctly. Somewhere. Oh, this was the deck that I was using when I was going to tournaments in real life. Yeah, Dark Rye Giratina Hydreigon. This was my dark box of choice back in the day. Night March. This was the first deck I built in real life. Night March. And people hated this deck. Consistent turn two knockouts. Ooh, what a what a time to be alive. Oh, spooky woobats. That I think I think these are the ones I was thinking of. Yeah. Oh yeah, with Gengar. Oh, I miss Gengar. What did he do again? Don't attack the Pokemon is now poisoned. And then switch, put three damage counters. Oh yeah, you would play Gengar with um, with the bats. Just put a bunch of damage counters wherever you want. Uh, Robo substitute, that's BM. That is BM. Okay, a different Mega Alakazam type deck, interesting. Xerneas Break. This deck could have been better. What did Xerneas Break even do? The normal Xerneas was a very good card. Okay, yeah, it was kind of like a Mewtwo-esque attack, but for fairy. And there was decent fairy energy acceleration back then, too. Alright, so I went off on a tangent there. Let me, let me look at chat again. Jack's been busy... Well, good luck with all that, Dragon. I'm glad that both your careers are doing well still. But yeah, like... If possible, definitely try to wait on the, the wedding thing. 
make it so that as many people can have as much fun as possible, you know? Well, it's good to see you again, Ice Princess, and I'm glad to be back. Yesterday was my first stream back in like three or four months. <laughs> Your Mega Alakazam IRL. Oh, wow, so they cho chose the plane over you. That sucks. Oh shit, really, Kev? Well, Kev, if you're interested in joining the tournaments I want to do in the future, I'm sure you heard me say plenty by now. I'm going to try and get cards for as many people as possible. Um, <laughs> Yo, I heard the pee pee poop poop in the middle, plus the pee pee. Holly, Holly, it's great to see you. How you doing? Thank you for the 34 months. Holy moly. Are you feeling better? I know, I know you were sick. Sick with the Rona. Well, the good news about that, G, rotation for this year just happened. You literally have a whole year of playing before you have to worry about rotation. So everything's set in stone right now. And um, next rotation is probably just going to be Sword Shield on. Right now, there's still a few. Hi, Cooper. Hi, Cooper. I think you turned down my volume. No, you didn't. Oh my god. Thank you for kisses. I'm glad you're doing better, Holly. I got scared once uh, I heard about that. And you kicked its butt. Hell yeah. Hopefully you haven't found any lingering side effects, huh? Cooper, don't eat my beard. You sicko. <laughs> Chocolate candy that looks like pebbles. That's kind of cool. No, thank you for the kisses. Thank you for the kisses. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, Cooper. All right. Now that I'm not getting b mauled by a dog, I think we can continue. Let's try and get a few more matches in. I've won, what, two out of three? Lost one? I want to get more coins to open more packs. Oh, I never looked up how much um, vivid voltage codes are going for these days. On day one of the release last week, they were going for almost a dollar each, which is super expensive for codes. <laughs> okay, good luck with that, Holly. But that actually sounds pretty tame from what I heard that other people had to go through. Glad to see you still okay. All right. Let me look up... Um what uh you know, let me let me look at um my boy Tricky Jim's store. See what they're selling codes for. Seventy five cents. Is that really how much they're going for? Let me check um I know this other site that I can get them on. Here, go over here, sword and shield. Wow, 78 cents? That's too expensive. This this set isn't even that good. I mean, there's the amazing rares, Fat Pika and Colossal. That's, and some special energies are decent. There's no reason that the, these codes should be that expensive still. Fuck buying codes, that's way too pricey. At that point, I'd rather just buy booster packs and get the codes that way. <laughs> get the cards. Alright, so we did a couple ADP. Let's play Lapras. I have more fun with this deck. Oh, 
Okay, so it was asymptomatic. Are you back at work now, Holly? Or are you still able to uh, be at home? So, uh, oh gee, I built this deck in real life. So even though I know I'm not going to be playing... I'll go second. Even though I know I won't be playing in person <laughs> for probably at least a year, if not more, um, I wanted to make this deck. I think it's pretty good. It's probably tier 2 deck. It's definitely not tier 1. But it's fun. Ooh, Crobat start really blows. Especially because I may only play one Crobat in this deck. Oh, that's fair, Holly. I mean, you do, uh, you are a nurse. Or, wait, you're, you're more fancy than a nurse now, right? You're like head head nurse, right? Or like super 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 nurse, super healthcare man woman McGee. Oh, that's really cool. How how hard is it to learn Yu-Gi-Oh? As someone that knows nothing about it, out of curiosity. I guess technically I also bought most of the cards I need for for a Pika Rom deck as well. Alright, so we got Snom. Maybe I should have used Pokemon Communication instead. It's kind of late now for that. Cooper's being a silly boy back there. Um... I think we gotta start by getting a Lapras out. Okay, so I do play a second Crobat. And I do have both the Dens. Is that cool dude 1774? Yo, Condus, thank you for the 46 months. Well, it's Tired Man 1774, I can guarantee you that one. Hard to learn alone. Okay, 15 minutes, that's not bad. Oh, and Scully, what's up, man? How you doing? So put down Lapras. Actually, wait, we'll hold off on that. We're going to Marnie. This is not the best of starts. And that's the biggest thing with Lapras. It's a good deck, but um, sometimes you get some bad, bad hands. You know what? I think we Crobat. Get more cards. We're playing against a Charizard deck? With Salamence? I don't know this deck, actually. There's Pokemon Communication, which I don't want to use because I want that for next turn. Although, getting a Frostmoth next turn would probably be pretty good. Um, I think we just park ourselves right here for now. Yo, what up, Mario fan? And how you doing, Condis? Thank you so much. How you doing? Ah, uh, I almost said good puppy, Holly. Yuna's such a good puppy. Cooper, you want help, don't you? Cooper fucking swiped his his little treat thing underneath the couch and he's swiping at it hopefully i don't miss anything important i'll help you out coop okay All right, looks like I didn't lose yet, so I got that going for me. All right, what do we got, what do we got, what do we got? 
<laughs> All right, we Pokemon communication the Snom away for a Frost Moth. I'm gonna grab this friend. I'm doing pretty good, Condus. Thank you for asking. We do that. We do that. We do this. Boom, boom. Then we... Ice Stance. Bow. And then we... Bow. And then we... Bow. Hopefully we get a switch. We got two switches. And another bucket. This is pretty good. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. That's a little scary. So you know what? I'm gonna fucking... I'm going all in. Well, let's see. He's at 220 HP. Actually, I kind of wish I had another Lapras going. Weak to water 220, which means I only have to do 110, which I already do. So... Actually, we might hold off and hope we can get another Lapras next turn. And right now, I think we just knock out Charizard. Yo, that 360 no-scope. Alright, there's another Lapras. Easy. I'm working a lot. Oh, that's awesome, Scully. Hopefully work has been good in other ways, too. And hopefully you guys have been as safe as possible. Yo, you guys didn't even get to see the deck do its wonders. Damn. Oh, well. I'll take the win, though. Yeah, give me the money. Oh, shit. I didn't even realize I had a water challenge today. Okay. Money! Okay. Ooh. Hell yeah. Oh, I got two of them, too? Alright, alright. <laughs> I'm afraid I'd have to look into it. That's a that's an interesting thought process, huh? Oh man, Cooper's asking to go out right now. I mean, I guess that's better than now now than uh, during a match. That's good to hear, Scully. Yo, we got some money and oh, another frost moth. Oh, you know what? That's good. I I can help. I can give that as an... Oh, wait, no, that's going to be trade... Well, then that means I could trade one of my non-trade locked ones for you guys if anybody's looking into making a Lapras deck. Because I don't need another one of those as far as I'm aware. And... Oh, shit. <laughs> Togepi, Cleffa, and Igl Iglybuff. It's the babies, dude. It's the babies. Rolling Panic, 120 plus. Flip a coin until you get tails. This attack does 30 more damage for each heads. Okay. Supreme Puff GX. Oh god. I'm gonna have to move close to read this. Hold on. Wait, what the fuck? Hold on. Am I reading that correctly? I think this says take another turn. Hold on, you know what? Before I before I start spreading misinformation, uh, let me. Take another turn after this one. Skip the between turn step. 
If this Pokemon has at least 14 extra fairy energy attached to it, in addition to this cost, your opponent shuffles all of their bench Pokemon and all cards attached to them into their deck. So not only you take another turn after this one, remember how I just asked before, because you guys mentioned Orangaroo in the video game, I just asked if there was a way to attack twice in one turn. Well, this is essentially that, with that GX attack. Now, granted, you can only use one GX attack each match, so like you would only get one extra attack phase, but that does it right there. Yo, what's up, Taystorm? How you doing? <laughs> Baby Rage. All right. I got to take Cooper on a quick walk, guys. Um, you guys look at the babies. And so people don't get pre-rolls. I'm going to run some ads while I do that. I, I hate saying that. Ads are for poopy butts, but I guess I'm a poopy butt now. So if you guys don't mind, I'm going to play some ads. I'm going to walk the boy, and then we'll be back for some more Pokemon action. Uh, just give me a little bit, okay?
Um, hello. Sorry, I'm a little out of breath still. Yeah, 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 I'm out of shape. What a, What of it? What of it? So, <laughs> Cooper's been doing this thing lately. When he wants to play, what he'll do is he kind of, um, you know how when dogs get playful, they do that like bow thing where uh, their front end they put down, but their ass is still up in the air. Well, <laughs> he kind of jumps into that position <laughs> and, um, but he'll like, <sighs> what's the best way to describe it? I've seen multiple dogs do this. They like jump in the air and they kind of like spread their arms out and then like jump into that position. Um, and then what we do is we jump at him and then he jumps back at us. So I was doing that with him out there. And then um, we found two baseballs in the yard, like under piles of leaves, which he's never touched in months and months. <laughs> he ran around, he picked one up. He's running around the yard going crazy. It was funny. He's a good boy. The Kraken? What kind of dog was it? <laughs> 60 Ultra Balls, huh? I can give you some Ultra Balls. What's your favorite deck, Tay? I don't know if I have it. Newer, newer decks, I'm still collecting all the cards I need. I have like... I could pretty much make any deck from previous rotations, but... Hello? I think I should be back now. <laughs> Only breaks sometimes. God, it it's not often that OBS <laughs> sees the means of OBS. Um it's not often that OBS crashes. Um but now I'm actually concerned uh, did that did that like get rid of my recording of the rest of the stream it might have that would suck um let me check that out really quick <laughs> okay no i think it okay cool no i think it did save the the recording up to that point So you said slow bro, right? I don't I don't have any of the new slow bros yet. Unfortunately. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I have old mega slow bro EX. I'm assuming you're talking about slow bro V, right? <laughs> yeah, just tape them both together. Yeah, this is this I'm assuming this is the one you were talking about. I don't have any of them yet. No? You're not talking about this one? <laughs> That's actually kind of scary. You know, I was actually just thinking about that recently, about the 10 minute long YouTube videos. Cause I've been, I've, I subscribed to a few um, guitar and music based channels and like all of them are between like 20 minutes and an hour long. And that just made me think. From Unbroken Bonds, eh? Unbroken Bonds, slow bro. see what this is this one right here protect the Pokemon that was sleep flip three coins this attack does a hundred damage for each heads if all of them are tails you lose the game is that <laughs> I'm assuming this is the one you were talking about oh yeah wait Holly you gifted a sub right I saw that and I forgot to say something because OBS crashed and that's my excuse um Thanks a lot, Holly. I appreciate that. 
really helps me out. <laughs> I'll take 20. You built a deck for this one? So it looks like I have one. One of these slow bros right now. If you can uh, get the deck list, I wouldn't mind taking a look at that. Obviously, I won't be able to build it tonight, but that's something I could do for the future. Boop, 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 bop, boop, boop, doo, doo. What is Cooper doing? Hold on a second, guys. I gotta go check on him. <laughs> what are you doing, Coop? You're making some noises, huh? What were you doing, Creepy? Give me one sec, guys. I gotta, I gotta give him some water. And okay, sounds good, Tay. Didn't I have a command for that? I could have sworn I had a command for that. 1v1, eh? Maybe. Give me one sec. Now I'm curious. I'm pretty sure I have a command for that. Did I get rid of it? Oh. I must have gotten rid of it. Or I'm just... Or I never did it before. God damn it, Holly. Alright, you know what? Screw it. If you want to do a 1v1, let me add you up. Send me a request. Fuck it. I'll take on anyone. <laughs> valid Pink Nub, Valid Cooper. Alright, I'll, I'll give you guys that one. I'll give you guys that one. What is that format? Is that expanded? I'm assuming that means expanded, right? Um, I don't even know what I would want to use. Oh, that's unlimited. Okay. I'll just use a newer deck since that's what I'm used to. You know what? I'll play, um... I'll play Real Eggs. <laughs> oh my god. You're pro gamer, Holly. Uh, yeah, I'll go first. Oh wait, no, I probably should have gone second. Shoot. That's who I wanted to start with, but I should have gone second. Oh my god, my 
my scroll. Glimwood Tangle, eh? Oh, the player flips any coins. Oh, this card. I remember reading about that. That's when I was taking my break, though. So I didn't play during that. Got a big charm, eh? Uh, fuck it. So we got that. Hmm. I think we gotta put that away. I think we go for Grookey, then Marnie. I think that's the play. I'll attach to him though first. Oh wait, this is turn one. I can't even Marnie anyway. Nor attack. You dropped it in a cup of water? Damn, dude. On a big fluffy pillow. Wow, cat food. Aren't you... Fuck. I, I ruined the joke because I forgot the word. Aren't you privileged? Privileged. That's the word I want to use. Boom. <laughs> Just gals being pals. That sucks, Mario fan. I've luckily never cracked any screens yet. On like any of my my devices throughout the years. What is Why is the game acting like I'm playing a theme deck right now? This is like most of my grass energies in the whole deck. So this is a crazy attack. You don't you can do it for free, so I don't even need energy. And then I can evolve grass Pokemon as many times as I want for the turn. Boom, just like that, I have real boom. What'd you forget to tell me, Bear? <laughs> oh no, Groons. <laughs> oh, that's funny. And you know, that's probably how I would crack my first phone, a feature like that. By the way, the boy has the zoomies right now. Let's put this on, maybe he'll run by. Oh, he killed me. Oh, I'm probably weak to water, right? No, fi fire, obviously. <laughs> it's monkey time. Monkey S. <laughs> <laughs> Your phone got ran over? Wow. So, um... This is a predicament to be in, huh? I think we go for a new... A new man, right? I think that's the play. And then I think we pass, I think. I don't want to get rid of this energy. I've already lost three energy. Yeah, I, I, I can't lose more, I think, if I want to win. I think we lose. I think we lose. Yeah, your tech's a little OP. Yeah, that's crazy. If all them are tails, you lose the game. Now, I have to ask you, Tay. So with this stadium, since you can ignore all the results, does the game end before, like, does that attack resolve before you can utilize the stadium? Or is it like an automatic thing? Or it might not even be automatic, but still work. Um. I will be giving him more cards, but I think I have the Marnie. 
Okay, you can still do another attack. That's nuts. That's nuts. I don't think I even need capture energy in this deck, to be completely honest. And then I think we drop Glower GX. What does the special energy do? I, I was gonna say, wait, I thought I thought my GX attack was supposed to shuffle that energy in, but the special energy stops that kind of effect. Okay. Ordinary rod. I'll actually utilize that. And then we Pokemon Communication. Ooh, maybe Shaman actually. Do that. And then we quick ball for this boy. Do that, attach. Okay. <laughs> you have a switch with only smash, huh? Oh, let me see that bear. Uh, let's see. Pad i7, 32 gigs of RAM. Ooh, that sounds awesome, bear. Have you played any games on it yet? And you got a new phone as well? Hell yeah, dude. That's awesome. I want to I wanna get a laptop for recording music. I may... Ooh, bossing. Are you going to get rid of my shaman? No, you're going after... Ooh. Um, I may actually want to get a MacBook one day, but that's so expensive. Oh my god, that does almost buy us. Uh, I almost said a Switch, a sub. Oh, that's cool, Holly. Dukes' mom uses a frother for her coffees. Two tag team cards, huh? Mallow and Lana... And yeah, we'll get our other boy, I guess. Wow, I already did two. Burn, confuse, and poison. I think I think he dies in between turns if I attack. I, I think that's the play. Or, no, actually, I think the real play... Wait, 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 hold on. Oh, I have to be able to discard two cards in order to use that. Yeah, so... I think we attach. Voltage beat. Ooh, we can only do one. Uh -oh. Okay, so new plan. New plan, new plan. We only do the switching part. Cooper, you need to relax for a sec, okay, Bubby? And that may have secured our win. How many slow bros are down? Oh, he still has a Ooh, but all his slow pokes are dead. He's got a if he has an ordinary rod. Oh, what's this? Bench barrier. Okay. Another bench barrier. Okay, you could put three damage counters. <laughs> then we got a freaking sobble over here. It's so funny seeing a crowbat in between all these little little babies. What's the M1 chip? What does that mean? I don't I don't know. 
I don't know. Logic Pro X and Max top two for music. Do have to dip. It was great seeing you again, G. And yeah, definitely hit me up. Hit me up, bruh. You have a good night, though. Alright, you have a good night as well, Holly. Thanks for being here. Um, we got another tag call. We got a switch. Voltage beat isn't useful because all my energies in play are discarded. Um, I mean, I could tag call and grab that for if I need it. Right now, we just do a whole bunch of damage for free. What is this sub? So, for this deck, I'm trying to think of a good alternative water attacker for Yute. GG indeed. Um, I mean, Keldeo GX might be worthwhile. That's def that's a good counter for if you run into Aeternatus. Um, I mean, a Lapras wouldn't be the worst thing in the world, but... Baby Lapras might not be worth throwing into a deck, honestly. Yeah, I think we just keep attacking. So it means it stops using x86 processors and start using Apple's own chips. Which can cause some compatibility issues. Oh, you know, I actually did see somebody talking about that today on Reddit because they were talking about... Oh, because World of Warcraft, with the newest update today, I think it was, they added in better Mac compatibility and some people were talking about the ARM processors and how it might be an issue. Oh, you do have another attacker? <laughs> but impossible to draw into. Is he prized? Damn, Shaman. 2020. GG, thanks for the match. You uh you started off strong. You really did. Um See that's tough. Do you play any ordinary rods? And what's your al alternate attacker? I feel like throwing in uh or one of the, the rods that might help save you. He was in the last three cards. Oh, I could have looked at your deck, couldn't I? Have I fucked up? If you want to go again, I feel like I I should use a different deck. I don't know what deck would be more fun and fair against your slow bro. Oh, Intellion. That's probably a better alternate attacker than than uh, Lapras at the very least. Probably better than Keldeo as well. Keldeo is more just to to counter Aethernetus. Who would I... What's a good, good deck to use? I mean, I could just throw out, throw out one of my old decks and see what it's like. I haven't played them in so long. Farting on rocks. Like, uh, who the fuck knows what that deck is? Fuck it, let's just use my old tournament deck that I used to use. Use all Pikachus. Yes, I'll go first. Honestly, like, I was never a huge fan of Apple either, but if I want a dedicated machine for like music recording and like editing and stuff, honestly, a MacBook or an iMac might be the way to go. <laughs> Oops, all Pikachus. Oh god, I haven't played these kinds of decks. So Ultra Ball is what? Discard two. Search your deck for a Pokemon, that's right. Um throwing the energy 
and Lysander. Mm. <laughs> we have N. So maybe I want to put down an attacker. Or no, Hoopa. That's right. In this format, you want to grab Hoopa. Hoopa Doopa. You use this ability. Grab a Darkrai. Oops. What does he do again? Oh, that's something to do with retreat cost. Um. Let's go with these friends. That's funny, Green Wolf. So you're doing pretty much the opposite. Throw our friends down. Put Float Stone on this man's. Look at the top six cards. Attach basic energy. For Pokemon on the bench. Boom. 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 Trainers, I miss this card. Can have another max elixir. God, I don't remember what that stadium does. God, decks back in the day were nuts. Look at this shit. Like, my deck never stops. That's why I played this. Dang, we failed the last two. There you go. You can finally take your turn. Sorry about that. God, I'm like on autopilot right now. Also, what's up, Zemtor? I don't think I said hi. Riding a bike, playing this deck again after so many years. I crave the hoopla, brother. <laughs> oh, that's such a good looking card. I'm doing pretty good, Zemtor. I'm doing pretty good, my man. Each Pokemon in play has no abilities. See, this was a counter to Garbodor back in the day. And like Trevenant decks. Ditch and Splash. Oh, that's interesting. Um, I think we just Sycamore. I have a hand of supporters right now. And that's just for special energy, which... Might be relevant, actually. Super Rod. Do have an energy to put back in. Oh, and Double Dragon can put it on our friend here. And that counts as two more dark energy for my attack. Versus Seeker. That's good for all the supporters I got rid of. Uh, I think we just attack. This feels unfair. I thought this match might be a little closer because this was an older deck, but I forgot how OP this deck was. Hi, Cooper. What's going on, buddy? Misty and Lorelei? What does this do? Three water energy cards. When you play this card, you may discard five other cards from your hand. If you do, during this turn, your water Pokemon can use their Jets attacks. Even if... You i never seen this card before. That's crazy. Quite situational, but... Looks like you're able to do it? 
100 more damage if this Pokemon is at least 6 extra water. Flip 10 coins instead. What the fuck? How'd you just do that? Oh, you discarded a bunch of supporters, didn't you? Didn't you? There's another Dark Rai, which is what I wanted, but I used all my Max Elixirs, right? I did. So I don't have too much of a energy engine right now. Um, do I want a Shaman? I don't think so. Maybe, actually. I don't have another Shaman. What a shame. Okay. All right. So what, you can't play tool, special energy, or stadium cards. That's probably not gonna lock them too much. <laughs> the Gary Tina. Yeah, I'm sorry, Tay. Um, this was not a good matchup, I'm sorry. Because I feel kind of bad, like, the decks I have right now are all pretty meta decks. While your deck is... can do big damage, it's obviously not quite as consistent as tier 1 decks. But I don't know. I don't know. You might still be able to compete just as well. This, this is a crazy deck. I like the synergy that this has. Cooper would be a TCG master. I mean, he is essentially um, rock rough already. <laughs> Cooper would eat <laughs> eat the deck to win. True. I may not win this still though. You got a couple of key knockouts. Got escape rope, fighting fury belt, special charge. Oh, he only needs two prizes to win. 180, 110, 170. Fighting Fury Belt gives me some HP though, right? Yeah, plus 40 HP. Brings me to 220, which used to be big. I think we retreat into Darkrai. Um, I think we lose. I think we lose. Oh, what's up, Greeny T? How you doing? And honestly, like, I do have modern decks. But I pulled this one out because I was thinking it might be more fair against Tay over here. But I realized, even though I might lose, it, it wasn't a good matchup. Cooper, you almost got caught in my wire. You could have hurt yourself, big guy. Oh, do you win? GG. Look at you. Okay. Okay. I see you. I see you. Oh, I still have the webcam on. Yo, what's up, Thurndos? Did you see my face? I don't think so, right? I don't remember moving over there. Wait, did you actually see my face? Oh, 
Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, you you trickster. You talk about my avatar in game. You motherfucker. Yeah, Tay, I thought the start, I thought I was pretty much going to win, but I also didn't know the strategy of your deck and I shouldn't have been so confident. Oh, Cooper. Oh, Cooper. You're such a booper. Also, Dark Shadow. I like your cool space high -yah. Although, <laughs> actually, it kind of makes it look like he just has giant eyebrows. But that's cool, too. Um, but, guys, I do think I am going to call it here. Uh, my stream did get cut off. I, I haven't been only been streaming for 30 minutes. It's been, I think, almost three hours. Um, he's so upset. True. Um, but I'm tired tonight, so I'm, I'm going to make this a pretty short stream. Um, so, depending on how Dugs feels, she might stream tomorrow. Um, but if not, I should be back tomorrow. And uh, it'll probably be more SM64 than more of this. Uh, but thanks for being here, guys. I had a lot of fun yet again. And uh, yeah, either I'll see you tomorrow or Dukes will see you tomorrow. Um, oh, yeah. So after this stream, I'm going to upload yesterday's video to YouTube, by the way. Um, so let me... If you guys want to subscribe to my YouTube channel, I'm, I'm going to be uploading all my VODs to, uh, to YouTube because I don't like, I don't like all the ad shit that Twitch is doing lately. Um, but with that said, I'm getting out of here. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you tomorrow and I love you all. I had a lot of fun. Thank you. Thank you.